Steve Little is handling the post-game duties. As we send you downstairs to the clubhouse, uh, his post-game comments are brought to you by Lina Kugels. Well, on the drop ball, yeah. well, obviously the umpire didn't think he had control. Then we go out and, uh, you know, they uh, appealed it. And New York said that somehow he did have control. So I think that's one of those instances where slow motion can hurt you a little bit. And uh, that's it looked like it came back to bite us there. And that's not really one that Gotti could challenge there or argue. That was just more or less him getting his point across. No, but you know it's it's kind of a it's kind of a gray area because the rule says you know it's you need to have control of the ball so that you can make the transfer. And you know when he went to move his glove, the ball to reach up for it, the ball fell out of the glove. So he really didn't go in and, and grab with his hand. So. I don't know. You, you know, we'd probably get a little more clarification on what the ruling is, what they what they saw there in New York. Do you think any of the arguing from Gardner and I are was just the fact that you guys are on a losing skid? I know at that point, you know, it was trying to tie the game, but you think that played into it at all? Well, I mean, everybody's frustrated, obviously. I mean, uh, it was nice to see us come back. Uh, we came back and uh, got some key hits, uh, got some good at bats, but yeah, obviously the frustration boils over. But then again. Uh, it didn't look like that he had the ball secured. Steve, Gertie had talked before the game about, you know, he broke it down pretty pretty simply about we're chasing too many pitches, and, and even during BP he said, you know, I'm going to throw some out of the zone and see if these guys are going to swing it. Did you feel like today, I know double-digit strikeouts, did you feel like today the guys are making some better adjustments, seeing the ball a little bit better, or is it more of what we saw before? I don't think in batting practice, we, I don't, you know, we don't chase during batting practice. I mean, it's it's the speed of the game. You know, mentally, you get sped up mentally and you feel like you need to, you know, do more than you really need to do. And that's that's what happens with young players. I mean, you get a bunch of young players together and, you know, that, that, that tends to happen. On veteran teams, you probably have seven or eight veteran players and you incorporate a younger player that's not counted on to do a whole lot. And that's kind of how, you know, you get your feet wet in an ideal situation. But here, where you got a bunch of young players on the team at the same time, and, you know, it, it tends to snowball, snowball every now and then. Steven, in the 11th, Joe had uh, two outs, guy in first and two strikes. Do, do you think he got a little overcautious with Rojas at first base and maybe got him, maybe took some focus away from Wallet there? No, I thought he made a bad pitch. I mean, you make a good pitch, and, and you know we're out of the inning, you know. And, and I think if, you know when you ask Joe, he's not he's going to tell you that wasn't you know a, a good pitch. So, you know you you know, uh, guy was running on the pitch. So, uh, I obviously told him to pitch out. So I thought he was going to run on the pitch, you know, uh, the, before. But uh, he ran on the breaking ball. So who knows? He might have been looking in at the catcher's signs as he was getting his lead. Those are things you have to look on. You know, at during the game, of course, the game and something that we're trying to teach a grinder to look at when, as he's given signs to look at the runner on first to make sure he's not glancing in at the at the at the signs. Steve, you have to take it as a positive sign there, though, scoring those two runs in the ninth inning. Well, absolutely. I mean, you know, Rojas is tough, and then you know we hit a line drive. Josh Harrison hits a line drive right to the left fielder. You know, to end the inning. Uh, Ronnie Rodriguez hit a ball that was just a, a grain of a bat from being a, a home run. So uh, they hit a ball in the 11th off of Joe that found found some uh, outfield grass and and the ball we hit that uh, didn't didn't it found some some leather. Thank you, Steve. Thanks. Appreciate. It.